Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm super excited. We're taking a look at one of the number one selling Fleetwoods in the country. This is the 2020 Fleetwood Bounder Model 35K, bath and a half. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then we're gonna give you three things we love about this motorhome and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. My name is Matt from Matt's RV Reviews. It's the world's only channel that gives you that true unbiased review about everything when it comes to RVs. And again, today I am super excited to be showing you this 2020 Bounder 35K. Now Andrea, you might be asking, hey Matt, haven't you done a video on this before? The answer is no, but maybe. So we've done a video on the 2020 Southwind 35K, and we've done a video on the 2020 Bounder 33C, but this is the Bounder 35K. I'm super excited to show everybody. Now, before we begin, I would like to say hi to Andrea. Hey Andrea. Hi everyone. Happy Memorial Day. Happy Memorial Day to everybody. I hope you have a fantastic weekend. And hey, I hope everybody's weather for today it's, is like the weather for today. Beautiful and sunshine. And hot. Just a little hot. <laughs> Absolutely. Andrea, I would like to say one last thing. Big shout out to Joyce and her family. They just bought this motorhome. Congratulations, guys. So uh, we'll be talking with them in a, in a few minutes. So let's begin. Model is 35K, but the actual tip to tip length is 36 feet, three inches. This is Fleetwood's top of the line motorhome. But again, it's very similar to the Southwind. The difference is the Southwind's gonna have more chrome. This one's gonna have black. And here's what I mean. You got the black headlights there, full body paint, black mirrors, and the black door handles, okay? Yeah, the camera, guys. Yes, camera in your left blinker and right blinker, but also the handles are black. Other than that, the Southwind's all chrome, chromed out, and it's very, very similar. It does have the Ford V10 engine, America. Right here, look at these, Andrea. They're the Michelins. Alcoa rims, I love that. The tires are 235-80R22.5. Bigger tires, bigger chassis, better ride. Exactly. Also, right here, you have a nice power awning with wind sensor. So if the wind blows too hard, not to worry. The awning will automatically retract itself back in. I love that. Right here, look, you have the Sansui TV. That's name brand. <laughs> <laughs> you got your Sony speakers out here and you got a DVD radio player right there. Nice. I love these doors. Look at them. Nice aluminum slam latch doors. Now, hey, Andrea. Yes. Can we give a disclaimer to everybody? Our normal reviews are about 28 minutes long. Yes. Believe me, we're going to be sub 20. You know why? It's hot. It's hot, y'all. So we're doing it fast. Right there, you got a propane quick connect. Nice. We got more storage right there. Nice pass through. Love that. Love it. We got more storage right there. Look at that. That's a place to tie, tie the uh, dog collar down. We can tie Yuna there. Yeah, all Yuna. And then right here, look at the water heater. I love, 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 love. They did a great job. How they continued the paint. Coming down the side here. Right here is your propane tank. Awesome, Andrea. Yes. We will have all the specifications about this motorhome. Lengths, tank sizes, widths, everything down in the description below. Also right here, bing. So everybody who's watching on TV can see it. Right there, you got a little bit more storage. Very nice, very nice. And then right here, Got more storage. More storage. Love it. Yep. And then you do have a ladder coming around the back. You have a nice rear fiberglass cap. Okay. Uh, you have a five. Oh, there's Oscar. Hi, Oscar. Hi, guys. Happy Memorial Day. Right there, you have a 5,000 pound hitch in this motorhome, 10 to 5,000 pounds. Right up there, you have a backup camera. We just went over that. Oh, and then right here is your fuel fill for the rear. 
um, and I love that so you can access it on both sides also you have a one-piece TPO roof let's go up there and take a look oh man uh oh did you stretch pretty high up do your stretches today <laughs> uh, I did it hold on here we go now all right up here on the roof you can see this is a nice one-piece TPO roof you have a solar panel already installed look at this max air covers already installed not one but two air conditioning units oh snap you got a king air digital antenna there's already a satellite on top and right there you do have your wi-fi ranger hello america oh matthew hold on oh, oh. great and if you haven't already, make sure you smash that thumbs up button. We know RV salesman's gonna take his fat ass up on the roof. Show you what features the roof has to offer. Nobody! Great. Now as you guys can hear the generators on, look at this. We optioned the bounder with the 50 amp power cord grill. I love that. I do too. Also, it has the surge guard protector. You come in zone A and 5500 generator. Your wet bay. Okay. Water purifier. Very simple. All that good stuff. Nice. And you got some storage in here. Perfect. And Andrea? Yes. That's just the other side of the storage. Andrea, the outside of this motorhome looks great, but it's 100 freaking degrees. Let's go take a look at the inside. <laughs> Is that your new and improved skip? That wasn't even skip. I don't even know what that was. Oh, that was a and the cargo ca carrying capacity on this is 1,817 pounds. Yep. Oh, it feels nice in here now. Oh, I am. It feels good. Thank goodness. Ugh. All right. As you can see, we have Slide the slides out. Slide outs are out. This is a bath and a half. You do have access to the half bath. Trust me, there's when plenty the slide of space. In. Yep. And you can still get to the bed. Nice master bedroom. And you got a bathroom back here. Love it. We gotta turn the lights on there. Great, All and if right. everybody could, again, if you could just leave down in the comments below. Let us know three things you like about this motorhome and three things you don't like about this motorhome. The more people who comment and smash that thumbs up, the more people YouTube likes to promote our video to. And Andrea. Yes. We just hit. 45,000 subscribers. Thank, Thank you so you much, guys. everyone. All right, let's check out this cockpit area. Let's turn that down so they can hear us. Oh man, but it feels so good. I know. I don't want to turn it down. Just turn down a little bit. There you go. All right, here's the command center. Cockpit area, I love this. You have your auto leveling here, cup holders, your blinds. Look at that. You have your privacy blinds. You also have daytime blinds that you can see through. Love I'm a it. huge fan of that. Everything's with, look, you're like a commander in the cockpit. You got your secret little cubby for snacks right here. I'm a huge fan. And Andrea, sit in that passenger orders. seat. Now look, that passenger seat is swiveled around. Actually, before you do that, there's a little thingy right there. Oh, this? Below it. Yep, yep, right there. Oh, I see it. Nope, oh, nope, above it. Above that. You're at the flaps there. Move the flap down. Move the flap down. Right there. Here? Andre, right there. I see No, this. down, below that. Oh. That. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh. very nice. Stay here. Yes. <laughs> cool. So now now pull your legs towards you. Uh-huh. Nope. Pull your legs towards you. Towards me like this? Yep. Put your feet down. Pull your legs towards you. There you go. <laughs> That's all you had to say is put it down like a normal recliner. My goodness. How do I swivel this? Uh well what we won't deal with that just show the this front part okay that's so like a 10 step process to look, swivel it guys, around this is one of my favorite features yep i love fleetwoods yep. everyone knows it uh let me see this camera we do have a cup holder here and then you can access the fan in your map lights You've got the window and as you can see you have a tv there uh -huh, where the uh -huh. bunk is we got cubbies let's put down the bunk it holds 500 pounds where's that button at here it is. Go. You gotta turn the engine off. Yes. There we go. Look how fast that goes. 
Yep. So the max is on is 500 pounds, and I love it. It's very comfortable. You got a TV there for your guests. Very nice. Uh, very I'm a huge nice. Fan of bunk over the cab. And then um, let's show the kitchen area. Why don't you show everybody what's in that? And both seats do swivel, guys. Yes. And there is a pedestal table that goes there. Now we have nice cabinetry. Oh, I love this. I love the shelves that come out. Very nice. And then we got another cabinet down here. Very nice. Awesome. Here's the dinette. One of my favorites. This dinette does drop down to make a bed, y'all. But let, let, let me tell you something. This is not like any other dinette. This isn't just a piece of foam on wood. They make these dinettes with springs in it just like a sofa. It is so nice. You have storage underneath the dinette. On both sides. I love it. You got cup holders. And then this table, it drops down and makes a bed. It is super nice. Thank you. You got your lights right there. Look, you got your daytime shades and privacy shades. This is awesome. Matt, show them how this dinette makes a bed. I love it. I know how simple it is. It's hot. I know, but I want them to see. But just just do it. Don't make please, me. please. Okay. Okay. Guys, this is why I love this dinette so much. It's so comfortable to sleep on if you have to, and it's so easy. No worrying about cushions coming off. You slide it down like that, and then you slide the other one with that little button right there. collar. See that? It just slides right into place, and it's actually really comfortable. Yep, yep. And then to get it back up, you know, it's easy. But look it's how nice. fast that is. Instead of having to take the pads off. Very nice. And then we have cabinets above. Very nice. It's a big cabinet here. Very nice cabinetry. Very nice. I'm a huge fan. And then down here, we have the living room area. You got, again, more cabinetry above. Andre, a lot of times manufacturers will put cabinetry here, but not down there. Right. This one, they did the whole thing. You have a nice L-shaped sectional. Little I like right that. There. You got a cabinet under here. Yeah. Like that. This is my favorite sofa, the L-shape. Or the, what do they call it, a J lounge? L-shaped sectional. I like it. It's very easy to get out, and it's very comfortable. I love it. I love it. It's very nice. And yeah, it's very easy to operate. Oh, I had to say that, didn't I? <laughs> there we go. And it's directly across from the TV. Yes, Sansui again, name brand. I love it. You Sound got your bar. fireplace right there. You got a little bit of storage right up here. Also, look, I was playing with this today, Andre. Look, you got your power, right? Mm -hmm. You can dim it. Cool. And then look at this. Cool. Oh, that's temperature. Okay, don't turn but that it on. But it even has a timer. Too hot. It even has a timer, so you can set it for three hours. Yes. And then have it shut off. Now, Andrea. Yes. It's now time for the MSRP. Burr, 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 burr. MSRP on this motorhome is $192,873 MSRP. Sale price shows $144,995. Right now, we do have it heavily, heavily discounted to $127,995. Whoa. But, Andrea, Joyce and her family didn't pay that. Joyce, tell everybody what you did. They called. I texted. They, I emailed. I FaceTimed. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. 301-906-0962 or mattsrvreviews at gmail.com or check out my website mattsrvreviews.com where you can get your official Matt's RV Review sticker Bing! right there. Also, there's a contact me page on the website. Andrea, let's continue the video. Show everybody the kitchen. All right. Look at this nice kitchen. I love the quality of the cabinetry. Uh -huh. I like the adjustable shelf here. Love it. Love it. I like how the backsplash is all the way across. Uh huh. We have solid surface countertops. Very nice. A double sink. Double sink, uh-huh, uh-huh. These are heavy. Yeah. Love that. I love that. Do you love the sink? I do. 
Look at that backsplash. Oh my god. Okay, so we have a cabinet here. Yep. We got sponges here. Sponges. Cabinet here. Uh huh. And then we have three drawers. One, two, <laughs> three. Andrea, that's three drawers. Thank you, Matt. I'm so glad you could count. Thank you. Thank you. We got a fan up here. Yep. We already saw the up on the roof. There's More a storage. cabinetry. And we have a nice convection microwave. Awesome. Which doesn't make sense since we have an oven as well. Well, just to have the option for both. I, I actually well, like that. This is the one thing I'm not a fan of. Yep. Is these heavy grates. Well, don't tell us about the things you're not a fan of. It's all time to tell us. I know. It's just heavy. Yep. We got three burner cooktop. And actually, guys, we have an oven as well. Look at that. It's a Dometic oven. I love it. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Look at this. Residential fridge that runs off your inverter. Check uh -huh. out the freezer mat. Very nice. Very nice. I love it. Now I'm going to lock it. Yep. All right. All right. Let's check out the half bath in here. Oh, look. There's a mirror there. I love it. That's Art Deco. Don't, don't uh. steal my Art Deco, <laughs> All right, so here's the bathroom. Got a nice fan up porcelain there. toilet. I love it. And Houston, we have a little problem. What's the problem? Oh, not, not a big problem. Not a big problem. Just a little problem. I'm just rubbing up here against it a little bit. It's okay, Andre. That they do it with all the half baths. It just is what it is. You know, you're just cozy in here. But it's okay, because I know the back bathroom is nice. And but we have got a toilet paper holder. Right there. Yep. You got your sink right here. Very big medicine cabinet. Nice big medicine cabinet. I even right like there. the counter space there. Yep. Cute little sink. Uh huh. Got a drawer, electrical outlet. Yep. And some storage. And that cute little look, that's adorable. It's like a place for magazines. Behind you. Yep. And then you got this right there. And then you got a towel rack. Very cute. Very nice. Cool. Now let's check out the bathroom. So hey, Andrea. Like we have a king size bed. Andrea. Oh, that's actually a pretty picture. Is this picture Art Deco? No. Oh, okay. But I do like the picture. It's very nice. So nice I king size bed. Look at this. I love this. And, and Joyce and her family pointed this out. This bed isn't as high as a lot of other manufacturers. Yes. Makes it a lot easier to, to climb get in. into and get into. I love that. Love the cabinet. You have your storage above. Okay. You got a sleep app station right there, a CPAP station. And right guys, there. the headboard is nice. And we also have a window on each side. Yes, and did we mention hidden hinge cabinetry throughout the motorhome? I'm a big fan of that. We have electrical outlet there. There's yep. your lights. Now, is there storage under the bed? Yes, there is. Oh yeah. Okay, great. That's actually a really good size storage. Very nice. I will say this, that's pretty heavy actually. Okay, so here we have the first wardrobe. Yep. Nice big wardrobe. Matt, underneath there's uh, cabinets yep. there. Yep, you got a TV right there. Matthew. TV with storage. You got, oh, look at that. Very important. Yep, drawers and breakers, yep. Okay, so over here, underneath the TV, you have a nice window with shades, countertop, and then you have drawers. six drawers there. Very, Very nice. nice. Uh -huh. And now for my favorite, over on this side, more cabinetry, and look at this. Prepped for a combo washer dryer. Love it. Love it. Very nice. And then we have more cabinetry underneath. Mm-hmm. Oh, with more drawers. I love that. Pull one out. I just like that, you know? Very nice. Oh, pocket door on the bathroom. And this has one of my favorite showers. Me too. Oh my god. Check Andrea. this out. Sit down. Not to mention, it's very good height in here. Mm. I love that there's a handle. Got the shower head. Very nice shower, Matthew. Andrea, it is hot in her. Am I sweating a little bit? Yes. I do like this drawer. I uh, do this, too. Not destroy this door. I like but Andrea, it. Look at this nice one piece fiberglass shower. Very big, very spacious, Stand up. very nice. I'm a huge fan. Very nice. Cool. Show everybody this. Why don't you open? Okay. Well, uh, how about you show it? There we go. Very nice. Got an adjustable shelf. We got 
four drawers there, guys. Four big drawers. That's I love nice. that. Show the sink. Okay, so look at this. Uh, I don't see these sinks normally. Yeah, it's very nice. I mean, you got a porcelain sink. Uh-huh. So you got a nice big medicine cabinet with adjustable yep. shelves. We have a fan up there. Nice. I love the counter space. Got a cabinet under here. Mm -hmm. And the toilet paper holder looks in a good spot. So let's see how that works out, Matt. We got a towel holder right here. Yep. Now it's time Sorry for the guys. toilet test. Toilet test part two. Nice porcelain toilet. Oh, oh my God. This is what I'm talking about. Andrea, I got plenty of space. It's the perfect height. It's a porcelain feel. Andrea, this is a prime pooping position. Yay! And you know what? I'm willing to let that one go for how, how nice this one was. And you know what, Matt? Yep. I will say this shower, mm -hmm. I approve. You already know. It's Andrea approved. It's Andrea approved. I love it. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Now, before everybody goes, it's now time we tell Joyce and her family the three things we love about this motorhome and the three things we dislike about it. Andrea, what should we do first? Let's do three things that we dislike about it. Perfect. Okay. One. Yes. We are not a fan of this cover just because it's this so is heavy. very heavy yeah. and there's no real place to put it. Right. It, now listen, with that said, it's very nice. It's very beautiful. It's Art Deco, <laughs> but it's heavy. Right. So that's one dislike. Two. Andrea. Yeah. It's very Don't hard. look at me. You know I'm partial to Fleetwood. Second dislike is the ladder in the back on the roof yep i yeah. hate that ladder to get up on the roof never been a fan of it never will be a fan of it and then my third dislike will be i will figure it out this half bath maybe it's me because i'm a bigger guy but the way i rubbed against the side listen is Let it a deal breaker see. nope um but yeah andre will sit See, Andre is good. It's just for me, you know, I'm just not a big fan of it. It's one of those things. This motorhome is so nice. It's hard to find three dislikes. It is. So we got to pick something. Now it's time for three things we love about this motorhome. Andrea, you want to go well, first? Well, you know, I'm going to say that I'm a big fan of the quality of Fleetwood. Okay? Yep. I love the sofa. I'm the material. I'm a big fan of it. I always will be. I don't see it a lot. It's, it's my favorite. Now listen, it's, it's a white material. But but it's but it's, you can easily wipe it's it off. Pet it's, resistant, yeah. water resistant. It's very nice. That's the first thing we love about this motorhome. Number two, I absolutely love this shower. Me too. Unbelievable. It's so space, spacious, and you have a seat in there to it's, sit down. It has depth. It has width and height. It has height. It's one piece fiberglass, and you have a shower. Andre, this is one of the best showers I've ever seen in a motorhome. Absolutely. Especially a gas motorhome. Absolutely. So that's two. And then three, mm, we'll end it up here. You guys know it. Love, 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 love the command centers in the Fleetwood products. Big fan of it. You know, I love the little cubby. I love the computer tray and everything. But that's it. That's the review. Thank you so much for watching. Joyce and her family, thank you so much for coming down to General RV in Ocala, Florida and buying this motorhome. We'll see you Friday. Happy Memorial Day to absolutely everybody. If you have any questions about this RV, please call me, text me, send me an email. It is mattsrvreviews at gmail.com or 301-906-0962 is my cell number. Or check out my website, mattsrvreviews.com. Andrea, do you have anything you want to say? Yes. Hey, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. We know Fleetwood reads the comments. We appreciate all your feedback. Also, Joyce. Um, and your family. It was really a pleasure to meet you guys, and I just hope you guys have happy camping in the future. Yes. Happy Memorial Day, everybody! Great. Thanks so much for watching, Andreo. We'll, we'll see, see you next time! time.